So today we're taking a look at this Jabra uh, earpiece. I bought this one to replace my more expensive um, Jawbone earpiece. I had that one for a couple of years. This one I just needed a quick one, a quick cheap one to replace it. And uh, I was going to give it a shot. It actually works out okay. I have pretty big ears. So uh, this one has this extra earpiece right here that kind of you can slide out if you don't like it. I like it because it hooks onto my ears because these won't stay inside of my ears for whatever reason. So uh, it's pretty comfortable. All right, so this is where I keep my earpiece plugged in. As you can see, it's just uh, a typical charger, but I use the small one from my old Jawbone and it works fine. But basically it just sits right there, plugs right in. When it's plugged in, it has this green light, knowing that it's charged, or to let you know that it's charging. So let's go ahead and take, pull it out and take a look at it. All right, so this is what it looks like when it's out of the charger. This is my Jabra. So this charger does not come with it, but you can use any mini USB uh, charger like this one. Again, this is from my Jawbone that I used to have, but I just keep it because it's a pretty good little charging cable. Here's the on and off switch right here. So there's the battery. And then if you want to turn it on, you just slide it over that way. And that turns on the Bluetooth. You can see the lights come on and uh, if you want to try to connect, you just pull it over there. And the green battery lets you know there is juice in it. And uh, I'm not too sure. Actually, this little piece right here is part of this clear earpiece. You can see it kind of move up and move down. And then here's the microphone right here. This is the charging hole. So you just put your mini USB in there and plug it in and it just charges right up. Right here is when you want to pick up a phone call or hang up a phone call when you're on the phone. You would just press this little button right here. And you can hear it talking when you press the button. And that's the lady. It's a voice prompt inside letting you know that when you press that, that this phone piece is connected to your cell phone. So there's the microphone right there. Um, it sits about halfway down the side of your face. I haven't had any issues with it. It actually works out pretty good. Uh, the only thing I don't really care for too much about this is the fit on the earpiece. It's a little wobbly. So when I have it in my ear, it's still, you can feel it kind of move back and forth like this a little bit. It doesn't seem to affect the sound quality, but um, it just doesn't feel secure and uh, uh, steady like some other your other earpiece that I've used. So if you're wondering how big this earpiece is, here's a side-by-side -side comparison of a quarter, a US quarter and the earpiece. So you can see the earpiece itself is probably about the size of a quarter. And then the microphone sits off the earpiece a little bit about a quarter, maybe one and a half quarters length from the earpiece. So the uh, fitting system on the earpiece is interchangeable. I bought this about eight months ago. Um, I don't like to keep things around my house, so I just threw away the box. So I don't remember exactly what's in there, but I know that you can change this clear earpiece out if you want to. So it just slides. Let me see if I can do it with one hand. So there you go. This one slides right out and it just goes right there into that little hole right there. This piece you can also change out uh, depending on what your ear size is. So yeah, it's a little dusty because I've had it for about eight months. But yeah, you can change that out and it just fits right here onto the, uh, right here above the speaker. This is what the, speak the sounds come out of. Once you remove that, you can kind of see a few of the details about the model information. I don't know what these mean, but uh, this is model OTE14 Jabra style. 
and then some other various maybe frequency numbers there at the bottom. I'm not sure what those numbers mean. Maybe you do. Uh, if you do, just leave a comment below. So this is made out of plastic. It has a silver color, so it kind of looks like it's metal, but it's not. See, as you can tell, it sounds just like my, da my plastic dashboard. And then the ear cushion, this is just made out of a soft rubber. It's pliable. This little piece helps hold it in your ear. And then this one is just a hard plastic. Something you might use for like a plastic fork or something. All right, so depending on which side of your head you use the earpiece on, let's say this, well, you can wear it on this side or this side. Um, so obviously the ear loop right here wouldn't, it works on this side, but it wouldn't work on this side because it'll be upside down. So this uh, earpiece you can take out like this, switch it around over to this side. And that way it just slides right on. If your ear were on that side, but it will not work on the right side until you switch this little loop around right here. It just goes right through the middle. So the sound quality on this, I think is pretty good. Um, it's hard for me to tell because again, I'm talking on it. I'm not the one receiving the sound on this earpiece. I don't really get a lot of complaints. Uh, once in a while, someone will ask me if I'm on a speakerphone because it sounds a little distant, but that's not too often. I usually encounter that when I'm talking on this earpiece inside the house. For whatever reason, when I'm talking on the earpiece inside the car, I don't really have any issues with it. And then um, I don't get a lot of background noise. It's definitely not as good as when you're talking on the handheld phone itself. But it's pretty good and it's a lot safer to use uh, when I'm out driving on the road here. All right, so there you have it. That is the Jabra earpiece. Um, hopefully you found the video useful. And if you like the video, be sure to click thumbs up. Also click the description if you want more information about this particular earpiece that I use. All right, thanks a lot for watching and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again.